I've waited years for this moment. I've been trying to get myself a camper van for my landscape photography trips for years and it's finally happened. So this is the Nissan NV200. Now I've done an enormous amount of research before I bought this and I've been looking at so many different models of camper vans. Everything from the, the Mazda Bongo to the Mitsubishi Delica to the VWs to all kinds of them and every single camper van apart from this one has one thing in common that is they burn fuel super quickly and they're very expensive to run. So I needed a vehicle which could be a MPV for everyday family use, taking my children to various clubs and things, as well as a camper van for me for my landscape photography trips. And so I couldn't just buy a normal camper van because that's not practical for everyday use. So what I've done in the end, I've decided to buy something which begins life as an MPV, but which I can convert at a drop of a hat into a place that I can sleep. And so it's extremely quickly to kind of switch from one to the other, which means it's a really amazing dual purpose vehicle for me. So the idea is, is that when I go on my trips, I, I can sleep where I'm shooting. And that's really important for me because I don't want to be, you know, often I'm often in Airbnbs and, you know, just basically finding local places, but I want to be staying right where I need to be so I can be up for sunrise in that location. So it's a much better way and, and more efficient way of working. I can also um, cook in this, I can sleep in this, so everything is really in the one place. So if I'm going on a landscape photography trip, all I have to do is lift up these two seats from at the back and then push these seats forward like so. And then I've got a really big space to put my bed and also a big space where I can easily do things like like this and cook I've got an awning which goes on the on the back um, and another awning for the side coming so this really becomes a, a fantastic portable landscape photography adventure vehicle and I'm so excited about it so any of you who have chosen a camper van before will know it's such a difficult choice between getting a full purpose, you know, camper van that's just used for that, or to go for something which is a bit of a hybrid like this, where you can have it as an MPV when you've got family in the car and then turn it into a camper when you are on trips. And for me, you know, I had to go for the latter because um, I need to be able to use this as a family vehicle as well as my photography work. So it really does serve as a, a dual purpose vehicle. But the second thing and the second reason why I went for this is because of its incredible fuel efficiency. If you if you do buy a Bongo or a Delica or one of those other ones, you know, they're, they're, they're super fun, but you're looking at about 18 to 20 miles per gallon, which is really, um, you know, thirsty. Whereas this will do about 53 miles per gallon. So the savings are enormous. And when you are doing long trips for landscape photography, because there's no point in buying one of these if you're not going to go off and do long trips. So, you know, when I'm heading up to Scotland and, you know, camping out um, in those areas, this is going to save me a huge amount of money compared to using one of those other uh, MPVs or um, camper vans. So it's going to be a massive saving and also it's got that great combi hybrid feel where you can just use it for different things.
So this was just a really quick update just to show you the new vehicle. I can't wait to get out and start to use this and to get on my first landscape photography trip with it. My wife has commissioned her as Rosie, so there we are. I'll see you soon, cheers.